Hello there and welcome back to my PC build series. We're now done the build and we're trying to boot up the existing Windows installation on my old SSD. In addition to solving that problem, we're also seeing that there is a red LED light on the motherboard. It's labeled VGA which usually means that there is an issue with the graphics card. After a lot of trial and error, I got rid of the red LED by doing two weird things. First of all, I realized that I've plugged the monitor into the motherboard instead of the GPU which has these port covers. And number two, I found out that the GPU is sometimes picky and wants the monitor to be on before the PC is turned on. Very weird. And just like that, no more red LED. I'm so glad I did not need to send back the GPU. The next issue was that my SSD with Windows 10 on it was not recognized as a bootable drive. To solve this, I turned on CSM support in BIOS, which is basically compatibility mode, because my Windows was installed a long time ago on a hard drive before being transferred to an SSD, so the installation is a bit outdated. Next, I removed my two hard drives and only left the SSD. Doing so, the PC was able to assume that the SSD was the bootable drive, and Windows started up. After that, I was able to go back and reinstall my hard drives. To update my drives, I installed the Gigabyte Motherboard Control Center GCC, which updated everything I needed. And there we have it, the gaming PC is operational. Aside from these minor issues, this was a very straightforward PC build. Thank you so much for joining me on this build, I hope it was as fun for you as it was for me. We will test out the PC and do a temperature test in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, make sure to subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.